Good morning, ACT students. So I'm covering the one that says arithmetic and pre-algebra. This is the very first one in our packet, but it, it says basic set notation in our packet. So that's what we're going to do today, this very first one. Um, I'm going to try to do these videos. You can pause them, rewind them, all those things on your own. I'm just gonna go at my own speed and then you can go from there. Okay, so the first thing that I would tell students to do is to remember um, about how what these symbols mean. So like U means union. So like if we were talking about Venn diagram, we would have like um, how many boys are in soccer. And if we wanted union, we would want everybody, everyone that's a boy and everyone that plays soccer, whether it's a boy or a girl. But if it's an intersection like this, intersection, it means it's the overlap. So I would typically ask someone in my class, who is a boy who plays soccer? And we would say, uh, you know, like, gosh. Anyways, but it would be everyone that was in between there, okay? So right here, looking at this one, it says, what is the union? So I'm looking for which, which one has all of these in there. So obviously that's A. And then over here, this one says, what is the intersection? So which one do they have alike? That's right, it's 121, 144, and 169. And so that's why it'd be D. Maybe pause just a minute as you try this one right here where it's asking you for the um, intersection and over here it's asking you to write the union. All right, so hopefully you paused and tried that. So uh, inter union, or excuse me, intersection is what they have alike. So we have the nines and the 11s, so that's C. And then union would be what they have all together. And so that would be two, nine, 11, and 15. Moving on to the next page, we would talk about how to use our calculator. Now, if you haven't done that yet, you should download the TI-84 calculator on your iPhone or Android. Um, but, oh, where's my calculator? There it is. So we would talk about the difference between these. In my calculator here, I would put in .007 and hit math, enter, enter. Like that, and I would get seven over a thousand. Where right here, these are repeating. So I do point eight five eight five eight five eight five eight five all the way across, and hit math enter enter. If you don't, if you just put point eight five five, you would get a very different answer. But we want repeat, so that should be eighty five over ninety nine. You guys are gonna do these on your own and give them to me. Right here, this is how to write it as a decimal. So I would have to move it twice, so that'd be 0.183. And then 40.3%, again, we move twice, and 0.403. The next one's rounding. My daughter has a little thing that says if it's five or higher, five we or add more. five or more, we five. add one more. Four and less, let it rest. There you go. So right here, if I'm rounding right here, this zero would make it let it rest. So 7.5, this four would be let it rest, 0 0.13. And right here, this zero would make it rest, 4.97. Right here, we would uh, use our calculator and I would have you guys work really fast and say, just plug it in and tell me what you get. We would have a big race and you guys would, um, put those in. Obviously like this, five times two is five times two is ten, minus one is nine. Some of them you don't need a calculator, but the the point of this would be to um, do it very quickly. Okay? So I would give you guys like a minute and you would do these. So I'll give you just a second. Hopefully you paused and tried it. One, four, two, thirteen. And then you would do the right side. Okay, so LCM is like the union, okay? So it's asking us, let me see if I can get this in pin here. So if I've got 16 UV, a lot of you guys would recognize that's like two times eight, two times four, two times two, so I'd have two times two times two times two times U times V. And then if I did 28 V squared, 
that's four times seven, two times two, so two times two times seven times V times V, and it's asking me for what they have in com or uh, all together, which means no repeats. So if I have a two here, I'm gonna cut that one out. Got a two here, mark that out. And then I got a V, mark that one out. So then I would have all of this 16, right? 16 out here times seven is 112. And then I'd have this U, and I would have, oop, I didn't mean to mark that one out, so I just V squared. So that's why it's D. But then I would show you that you can do this in your calculator in math, right, eight. So if I were to put in math, right, eight, and then I'd put in my two numbers, 16 comma 28, enter, you can see it also give me 112, right? So looking through this one, if I did the same thing, if I did math right eight and I did 40 comma 30, I would get 120. I have a guest.